Alright, so this is an update on the Whiplash 24 with a Hobby King Elbow motor. Alright, so progress so far. Uh, the custom motor mount I made to connect the motor and the boat. This here is a, a copper tube. Uh, let me just get this theory, but. Stupid camera. Anyway. This troop is a, a hollow inside, so um, the, the, that's going to be the what intake. Uh, I utilize the, the custom um, flexible shaft housing in the boat. Um, the water can come from the copper troop straight through the flex shaft housing. So um, and I won't have to be boring any more holes on the boat because I don't really want to damage the original boat itself. Just in case in the future I want to go back to normal. Anyway, so this is what's cooling inside now. Uh, still, I'm more clean up for doing the boat. This, well, from the exit of the flesh shaft housing to the tube, I have a Y splitter. One going to the ESC and one going straight to the motor so there will be no hot water coming from the ESC and then going to the motor or from the motor going to the ESC it's just straight cool water going directly to the ESC and directly to the motor so um, oh also this is the new mount for the Sorvo so um, there was originally there was a box a water seal box here that had a small sorrow and also um, the receiver but um, I took that out and I installed a new bigger with more torque sorrow and this is a, a little bracket you should say I made for it uh, so far the progress is going very nice um, I plan to stick the battery up in the bow so that um, the, it will have a better sense of gravity so it won't be most of the weight won't be at the back because the motor has a reasonable amount of weight itself so so the battery in front will be balancing it out more better so this is the current progress so far um, next I'm going to to check the flotation of the boat um, so this is it so far